Hello, 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 everyone. We are back at it again with another episode of our Vardy learning series. This one was a bit of a banger. We uh, ended up playing against quite a lot of good players. We played against Santoran, uh, BLT Knight, I believe, and Labrov. Um, the game is kind of... It starts off complete disaster. Our mid laner has the wrong rune page. Everyone is losing. We have a tilted jungler, down seers, down experience. But through the power of love and the power of Bard, we managed to squeeze out a win. The way we did it basically is with a very few tips of like very patient cues, understanding how to arm when you're playing with a champion like Olaf. You never want to, to ult the people that he's already auto attacking because he needs to continuously auto attack to remain his to retain in his ult, right? Um, so the ult is very much used to deny the backline for uh, for helping out the Javan. You will see me very hard trying to use my ult continuously on the smolder, either to straight up just hit him or place it in a way where it forces him to E away from the fight, in which is initially just, it takes him away from the fight, so it's a 5v4 for two, three or four seconds or something like that. And that's most of the time, all the time we need, right? We also very heavily try to remember that people do not play the game correctly all the time and it is better to do the wrong thing together than the right thing alone i do say this a lot but it's something i forget even myself but we all have to remember that apes together are strong right um so yeah thank you so much for for watching it if you have any questions about the game or anything else or if you have wishes for future videos please let us know we want to listen to everyone have a wonderful day from my last game we need to make sure that this Uria has a very good game. Because we, we saw what happened if he tilts, right? We saw what happens if he tilts. I got Kensuke again on Syndra, which is awesome. So your general concept on current but is passive lane push statements into AD hardsteel into AP. Yeah, exactly. Exactly what I st stated in uh, the Bard guide as well. Tilt temp? No, I need win. I need LP. I need LP. I will be attempting to tilt Santarin. That's exactly uh, what we want to try to do. Danata has a stronger laning pace than Bart, strictly be uh, because he has better range than Bart. I think the Olaf pick is incredible in this game, by the way. So good into Granata, so good into Ash. Maybe not that good into Javan though, because Javan could ult, ult Olaf, right? And then just EQ out, and then Olaf can't move anywhere because no flash, right? Got the first strike gold. 12 gold acquired. Feels good. We have both Syndra and we have Yoni. We cannot lose, Chad. We are we have the OP champions. Uh you have to see if he had bone planning, but uh he may have lost that to the first Q that Syndra did over here. Nice. But yeah, we will barely be interacting. But ouch. This is quite normal by the way. Olaf can't pass over Javantar doing his ult, right? No. It's a wall, right? So unless he has flash, he can't go over it. That one is already prepped. Oh maybe it wasn't. As farms perfectly right now. I fucked up there. That's like I didn't prep him correctly. The Yoni is losing against Molder right now, which is interesting. Like to the point where Yoni got dope between tier one and tier two. That's crazy. And he didn't even flash. How? 
<laughs> Wait, Yona has Selectocute? Why? Nice sidestep. Why does he have Electrocute on Yone? <laughs> what was he playing last game? He played Silas last game. He has his Silas rune page on, dude. No, he does not. He changed the rune page. It's not the same as the Silas one from last game. But yeah, you see. I'm bad at interacting with them, so I don't need my potions. So even when I'm losing the lane, as we are right now, because I spam 100 gold, I'm actually not going to fall behind the enemy support, at least. I don't think it's lethality on. Let Kugi run out first, and then we collect this, and then we are fine again. Shit, would have died. We have all the mana we need here. Cool. Got the barrier. I didn't overpause any summoners. I have to remember we have to survive after Renata W is over as well. Yep. You just need to hit the initial stun. Ah. Good try. Ah, Guardian, right? Like, that was the E shield pop. I'm not doing well. You're right. Let's push. I'm not doing well. My man Yone is making Yone look fucking bad. Clicking tab is a mistake. How is this smolder? <laughs> Winning mid lane. Let's ignite. Yaman is level 6, while all of us still level 5. Oh. Did he just get a kill here? Nice. That's just a free kill. Because Renat has did, Ash now has to respect and run backwards. So we get a small freeze here. Kiba, thank you so much for the 22 months. Much, much love. Wasn't even close. Do I need to be worried about an Asha? Nope. Flash for flash. What is uh, the best advice to upgrade your macro? Uh, but review your games. But review your games. Uh, 
SRO may be coming. Nope. Nope. No SRO. Hmm. Top lane is 30 CS down. Mid lane is 30 CS down. 20 CS down. Bot lane is even. Jungle is probably one or two camps behind. Oh, let's execute Yone! Just to get the 44 gold, you know? I can do. That's too many. That's too many. I tried to all them portal and all that, but uh, nope. It's just a bit too deep, right? Poor Zion, dude. He can't farm. He's losing platings. Yeah, it's a very worrisome game, Chad. Very worrisome. As much as it's six to four, they're getting objectives, right? We kill Ashia, we kill Ashia. Easier to do the dragon now as well. Mm. This is looking very fucking bad. Yep, very fucking bad. Smaller scaling, dude. Smaller is 115 stacks. 14. Really? A fucking SRO hitting me right in the face, dude. Oh, top lane tower is gone. It's hard to get tank stats if you're not farming. I am back to the other games where once again my my solo laners are just not human people. Like they're both just losing so hard. They're both losing so fucking hard. Level 9 Olaf now, nice. Too bad he missed a point blank stun. But then again, then uh, S did that. Great. Jarvan is top lane.
We missed everything. The fucking squad is here, dude. I am trying my very best. But it is not enough. Interesting to see a Yone would electrocute, if you ask me. started doing it again just like last game it's interesting to have a um, like how are we supposed to win with a yone like even if you fuck up electrocute how do you lose to a smolder he, he was dove between tier one and tier two This Smolder is gonna pentacle in this game. I can nearly guarantee you that. He has 200 stacks already. You didn't get over the wall. The worst part even is that there's not even like objective bounties. Like we're losing everywhere. Like my top laner is as far behind as the fucking. Like it's not just mid lane that's losing. It's also a super fit of war. Super fit, Javan as well. Like the only ones that are not super strong is bot lane, right? It's night that why. Night brainwashed my Yone to go electrocute or what? Is that what you're trying to say? Why is Cyan top lane? Guess no one is bot lane. Easy chaos. Uh, if I don't kill there, then he does the pop, uh, his bounce thingy on the R, and then he W's over the wall, and then he's out. Oh, he's already 225 stacks. We do, but only with Syndra, right? We only have damage with Syndra. Maybe let the minions kill the inhibitors, actually.
This dude flashed, right? Oof. Two kills. Cyan took both of them, though. This is fun. Is that any point in the game where it's not gonna hurt the Yoni that he doesn't have lethal tempo and instead have electrocute? It's so crazy to me that there's no object about this. Like, we are so far behind right now, no? We have no void grubs. We have one dragon, they have one dragon, and they have four more towers than us as well. And then, of course, they have five more kills. I think the only reason we don't have object bounty is because our Ash is this far behind. Ah, three eyes and some of him already. Oh, what a great ass arrow. Burn is gonna be played now. I guess not, maybe? There's too many! I am surrounded! What the fucking absolute bullshit. They wasted a world on me. And now we just have to kill the Baron. Nice! Pull up moment. Where's your Arwald, huh? Ha! Huh? Where's your Arwald, you bastards? Where is the Arwald? Yeah, well, Olaf is an insane pig into enemy team come. It's so good. The issue here is that enemy team is just so accelerated that Olaf just dies so quickly. Like, so, so quickly. Enemy team is so insanely accelerated. I'm also never really gonna feel tanky. Has uh, been caught, but that's fine. You have to reset here. We cannot go for that. We unironically cannot go for that. There's no way in hell. Not after with Olaf dying in river right there, but this play is good, right? We go with reset, we catch mid lane, we TP top lane, then we rotate for the mid lane turret here. This is by far the most macro, uh, like the best macro decision we can make. Decent over Swifties on this build. Do you think you need more movement speed when you already have the dead man's plate? Oh 
Oh, did she just take the wrong path? Oof. We can give this dragon right easily. We can easily give this dragon, but we should want to play with the tower. Ah, meh, meh. They for sure have a ward in here, dude. There's a blasting random shit in there. Her combo just barely broke my shield. Really want this time, Anata. Hit the slow. Oh. Fuck you, Sindarin! Fuck you! You think you're safe? I can stun you on the thing you can walk through. Cause bad. Sindra is all this bullshit, by the way. Like, Smola just fucking evaporated even after he uh, Cinder was dead. Uh, kind of feel like it's Randuin's, right? Oh, that was. Yeah, we got a lot of gold doing that, Baron. Olaf has GA now. Yone has IE now as well, like we're hitting some good power spikes. Like some really good power spikes. I'm starting to be quite tanky as well, even though Smolder is kinda... Oh, we soon have all the Splinters as well. How many is it? Is it 1 in 20? We win. Yes! I am the greatest! I think we win. I think we win. I think we win. I think we win. Right? We win. Maybe not. We have to. We have to win. It's only the fucking Granata and Ash. They're weak as fuck. And yes! Fuck! Let's go! Night who? Santorin who? Sorry, I do love you. Huge, and we are buffed the challenger cut off again. I no longer have to stress.